So a lot has been going around about the validity of this. And is your 4K disc displaying true HDR or high dynamic range? Of course it is. Dynamic range is a range. It is the ratio between the darkest point and the lightest point of an image. And it's called high dynamic range because it's a higher, wider ratio. Brightness and luminosity are only part of the equation. HDR is really a coloring process and it has a wider gradation, a much larger gradation than standard dynamic range, which is why if you look at your standard Blu-rays, you'll notice they are a little oversaturated as opposed to a 4K Blu-ray, which will look a little bit more balanced in terms of the shadows, the mid-tones, the highlights, and the brightness and the saturation of all the colors. This is due to the greater ratio delivered by HDR. Let's say you have a scene with a bright light coming through a window into a darker room. On a disc with standard dynamic range, you will get a greater intensity from the light than if high dynamic range is used because the gap is smaller and has less subtlety from dark to light. It's a harsher and more abrupt jump resulting in more perfect white or more perfect black. HDR has a slower change from dark to light, more accurately representing the way we view the natural world. It should also be noted that not all 4K discs support Dolby Vision, which is a wider HDR than standard HDR10. For films with duller and more subdued photography, Dolby Vision is unnecessary. If you don't have need of its color bit depth, don't use it. And even though, yes, 4K Blu-rays are displaying a true HDR image, I think there is still a little bit of false advertising or maybe misleading information happening. It seems to me that people have been led to believe that 4K and HDR are the same thing. After all, you're constantly seeing 4K HDR. 4K is an image resolution. HDR is a coloring process. So even if the brightness of a 4K Blu-ray peaks at around 200 nits, or maybe even 180, 170 nits, it can still be an HDR image, as long as the gap between dark and light is a certain ratio. Some cinematographers just don't want to go real bright. It's a style choice. Especially if you're shooting the sun, you don't want to shoot it at full brightness because you'll destroy your camera. Some codecs also capture a wider HDR than others. The ratio on some of these is wider than others. So fake HDR is not a thing. 